So that is a video that was posted to TikTok by the account GAWPU. And the teacher who you can hear speaking over that video has apparently been let go. And it's not impossible to figure out why. Those Muslim students doing their prayer, she described that as magic and says she has a problem with it. And it's probably due to the fact that she says, I believe in Jesus, which again, so do they. Like, you could, <laughs> that doesn't mean that they can't do their prayer. Now, there is, of course, the question of she says that they were doing it in her office. And there's a lot that we don't know about the specifics of this. I don't know why exactly they were doing that in her office. But even if that was her main concern, you do not express it by declaring religious observation of a different faith as magic and talking about how you oppose it because of your own political beliefs. That's where I think you lose a lot of people that might have been on your side otherwise. But River, what do you think? Yeah, I mean, again, I'm going in this audio only. So I think, I mean, even if kids are praying in your office, like you, there's so many ways to say like, hey, don't do that in here, it's my office. I'll, let me help you find a space for that. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. It's what what has happened that, but I mean, you know, I, 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 yeah. I, like you can't, children should be allowed to believe in magic, which is a separate thing than their religion. I just want to say you both, <laughs> neither thing should be uh, uh, kicked out in a, in a school setting. These are children. They should be able to express themselves in any way they see fit, you know? Like it's, mm. it's yeah, it's it's obviously it's bizarre. I would I would love to know about the thing. Again, you, like if if they're not supposed to be in the office, that's one thing. That is maybe a legitimate problem to have there. But you're not supposed to make a Muslim students feel bad for their faith specifically and denigrate it as a teacher. That is not your job. Um, and heads up to Jesse Waters. Uh, what we're doing here is speaking out in defense of actual people being actively mocked for their faith. Not Christians in a largely Christian society where they're surrounded by Christian holiday ornaments saying, how dare there be one place where we don't have our chosen decorations. A little bit of different level of discrimination there. Check out the Damage Report podcast each day, wherever you get your podcasts, whether Pocket Casts or Stitcher or iTunes. You can join me as I give you the news and stories you want, with a range of co hosts and interview guests jumping in on the fun each day. Again, that's the Damage Report, wherever you get your podcasts. And if you get them at iTunes, don't forget to rate and review. Sometimes I'll read them live on the show.